hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talks video guys on today's video we are going to be doing an overview of streamlab so streamlab or um, just like omelet application or omelet app it's a multiple platform streaming application that allows you to stream on multiple platforms just like facebook youtube tiktok and twitch so these also have more application they can live stream on but i just call the popular ones for you so if you don't have streamlab go ahead and open the android play store or your play store and then search for streamlab go ahead and type in stream lab l e b L E B and then search for the application. It's probably going to be the first application that displays, but if that is not, this is the application logo and icon right there. Um, this first one right here, go ahead and click on that and tap on install to install the application. But because I already have the application installed, I'm going to click on open. So it's going to open the application and it requires you to log in with a particular device. So I'm going to actually select Facebook because I'm already logged in. Um, or I want to, I'm making this tutorial for Facebook purpose. But if you're live streaming to YouTube, all you need to do is to choose YouTube so that you log into your YouTube account. The same with um, Twitch. And also if you want to um, live stream with a custom you are um, with a custom link, you can go ahead and click on custom RTMP. All right, but I'm going to click on Facebook and then it's going to load up Facebook and it's going to ask you to log into Facebook and you have to log into Facebook and then approve this application to access your Facebook so that you'll be able to live stream on Facebook. So the reason why it's displaying is not giving me this option to um, enable is because I already have it enabled previously, but if it's your first time, you need to accept the Facebook um, login and then login successfully. So once you've logged in and you want to live stream, the first option is actually going to allow you to um, record if you are not a gamer, you'll be able to record your environment, making use of your camera. But if you are a gamer and trying, or even though you are not a gamer, but you just want to record your screen, you, you want to record an application on your screen just for a tutorial purpose, all you need to do is to make use of um, this option that says stream your game click on that and it's going to give you an option to actually enable your camera or ignore that and also enable your uh, microphone. So I'm going to click on enable the microphone and I'm going to enable that. If I do not want to enable my camera, all I need to do is to tap outside or just um, press backward, but you have to do that. I think right now it's compulsory. So I will have to enable the camera and then I'm going to tap yes. So I do not want to start recording. So I'm going to cancel that out. But if I want to start live streaming, I, I can just go ahead and tap on go live and it start going live. And also guys, um, the place is actually displaying right now is on my camera section. So if I click on flip camera, it's going to display the front of my camera, but because um, the room currently is dark, so it's not going to be displaying anything for you guys. And there are different options here, guys. The first one is the chat option, which is if anybody's um, chatting with you on your live streaming, but because you are not live, all these options are not going to be active. And also you can mute the audio going in to the game so if you want to listen to only the sound if you want your fans to listen to only the sound in the game just go ahead and mute your audio and they will, your fans will no longer be able to hear you but be able to be listening to you and also if you want to create an event you can click on this event list to see um event list you've created so far i'm going to close that out so um on the menu option right there there are even more options you can set your team you can claim a remote you can um claim a reward if somebody is giving you a reward on your live streaming you can disconnect um the protection you can um change your streaming settings check the alert and go ahead and check the account setting the account setting actually allows you to either log out or log into other accounts and then on this bottom area it says that you should use advanced setting that is if this is not your first time of using um streamlab and you're already familiar with everything go ahead and click on this option and then click on continue and it's going to give you a different options based on this particular mode but actually if you're not okay with that you can always revise back by clicking on on the switch to simple mode so it's going to switch it back to the simple mode you can click on this team you'll be able to um 
change the theme that you want to make use of you notice um the default one is just going to display the default theme for you and then if you choose this cyber it's going to choose this particular theme let me click on it so that you see but actually um this one is not going to be free so you need to join the prime which is probably a paid subscription in order for you guys to make use of that and i'm not interested in making use of that so i just click that out the same thing with all of this one if you pay for the application to use the premium up you can go ahead and use any team you want right here there are several of them um as i'm scrolling down if you think um you can go ahead and scroll down to see the um their library and what they have on in store so i'm going to navigate back because i'm not interested in that and also for the reward the same thing um if you notice um there is this reward for um live streaming so if i went live if i stream i'm going to get one point and if i stream even longer i'm going to um get like 100 points even more the same thing right here 50 points to get a viewer and then at 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 it goes there are uh, even more rewards going on so um if you finish you can easily re um redeem your reward like right here when you redeem re this reward you will be able to actually make use of um these teams available here or you can multi stream you can stream on this multiple platform at the same time and also um you can disconnect um your internet protection and then there are, there is a lot of even more you notice you can remove your watermark once you reach 100 points so it actually make it more interesting for you guys to get this reward which is probably very different from omelette occurred um so guys these are all of the features that is included on the application and if you feel like um you are having any issue whenever you're having any issues making use of this application you can always click on this support right here and you notice um this this is my user id um they might ask you for your user id once you contact the support so make sure you memorize your own user id and then click on help and it's going to navigate you to your uh, main browser so you have to select any browser and it's going to look up and open the streamlab um home content and under this area you notice the active one is on mobile and you can see there are even more solutions that you can go ahead and read that is if it's solving your issue but if it's not solving your issue i think there is also a contact contact us page on streamlab where you can check their community okay this is it this is their community this is the discord and you can also submit a ticket right there and you can also check their general and just go ahead and check out this support section and easily they will be able to attend to you and probably fix your issue for you so let me navigate back to um the application i just have to click on the menu icon because that's a browser and then tap on the um particular application to open streamlab so i'm going to navigate back by tapping the back button on um on the phone built-in on the phone so if anytime you want to go prime which is premium you can always go ahead and click on this go premium and you can see the exact amount which is probably very expensive compared to nigeria i have to pay 58k which is almost 60,000 naira um this is very expensive so this is their monthly subscription if that is what you are interested in you can always tap that and then hit on join once you select any button that you want to join probably the monthly subscription tap on that and click on the join button to join and if it's a um, annual subscription click on the annual subscription and join and there you go you'll be able to join the annual subscription just to get a unique team that is all the annual subscription does it gives you a unique team and it also gives you an option to live stream to multiple platform but there are other application free application that does that too i'm going to be making more videos about that so on my next video i'm going to be diving in how to live stream on your facebook page making use of this particular application so this is just an overview of um, streamlab i hope it's helpful if it is smash like subscribe to the channel if you have any question leave that on the comment section i'm going to see you on my next video please stay safe and peace